For me, here in Chicago, our community is uh, very important. Para mí es, es algo que tenemos que, que cuidar mucho, porque tenemos tanta gente que viene y emigra de otros países para acá, y vienen y a veces no entienden lo que es las bases que están puestas ya aquí en Chicago. Entonces, para nosotros es muy importante, ya que tenemos mucho tiempo acá, siendo los líderes de esta comunidad que viene, en cómo los vamos a ayudar a tener el conocimiento necesario para salir adelante. So right here we have a chicken sheep. It's a fish normally that it serves on the uh, Riviera Maya. Oh. My mouth gets watery. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, basically, you know, it's a achote, marinated, uh, mahi mahi, a little uh, lemon zest, uh, orange, uh, guajillo, garlic, mm -hmm. and then with the fish, it gets cooked with the uh, banana, banana leaves. leaves. Oh. We wrap it on banana leaves and we bake. We serve it with uh, uh, habanero bourbon. Blanc. Habanero Bourbon has shallows, white wine, heavy cream, a little touch of heavy cream, and butter, and roasted garlic, and the habanero. So it's a little spicy, but it's really delicious, okay? Oh my God. Community knows what they need. Each one in the neighborhood knows their neighborhood intimately and knows their aspirations for that neighborhood. But I also think it's important that we don't think that communities are siloed. They are part of a larger ecosystem in Chicago. And so this time I think it's really important that we think about taking the aspirations of our communities and thinking about how do we create bringing more resources to communities? How do we do that across all of the sectors of, of our city? Um, ensuring that public policy is aligning with what we need to do to bring resources to our communities. No one does it alone. We're really just stewarding resources to community and really saying community knows what they want our dream. And we saw that true within the COVID crisis around communities really stepping up and taking care of one another. We take care of family members, we take care of community members. For me, that really transformed and really just made uh, community empowerment that much more palpable. So I think that lends itself to how we can do better. It's really listening to community needs. What, are, what would make this community thrive? What are the resources that are needed? What are your ideas to make Chicago a better Chicago? Because the solutions are in the people. And I firmly believe that Given our traditions and our cultures and our practices, there's so much that we bring to the table, the history of our people and the way that we operate, the way that we think and infuse our art and culture into our ways of being, that we can really transform Chicago. We can really be part of those future generations redesigning the systems that, that currently exist. CBS Chicago is proud to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month and the history makers in our community.